Good morning, everybody, and welcome back to Ordinary Adventures. Aloha. Yes, aloha. It is our first morning here at Disney's Alani in Oahu, Hawaii, and I'm hungry. I'm hungry too. Let's go get some breakfast. Maybe see if we can meet Mickey and Minnie. Yeah, or some kind of characters. Yeah. And see what kind of trouble we can get up to. Come with us on this adventure. <laughs> Thank you for you too. For the 11th floor, it says Umi Kamikai. What's the song? I don't know, I can't tell. Can you? Bare necessities. Yeah. <laughs> Got it the exact same second you did. Floor. So, where is the place we're going? I don't know, but can you just look? This looks like a Disneyland map. Yeah. <laughs> It's huge. I think we're going to Olu the Cafe. Olu Cafe, which is 41. That is over here. So it's just, where are we? We're right here. So I think if we go. We're on a bridge over. Oh yeah, it's the Lazy oh, River. Look at how amazing the Lazy River looks. I can't wait. I know. I cannot wait. Oh look, they got like a fun, what do you call that? Where it's like... A splash zone area. Splash zone, yeah. I wonder if adults are allowed to go in there. Oh, this is, oh, right is this where you go snorkeling? I don't know. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I totally didn't even realize this was a thing here. Oh, wow. I want to go in there. Look at yeah, all the fishes. I think this is where you go snor snorkeling. That's so fun. Did we find it? Found it. We did it. So the options at this place are limited because of COVID. They have a, a breakfast menu here with some acai bowls, some eggs and things. Breakfast sandwiches, flatbreads. Wow. Oh, and some breakfast for little kids. But it looks like at lunch they start selling some poke bowls and some sa hot sandwiches, flatbreads. Oh, I thought that was a margarita, like a drink. <laughs> Pizza. It all looks so delicious. I kind of want to get like something tropical, but then also want to just get like something boring. Like. <laughs> Like eggs and bacon? I don't know, what are you going to get? You know what, I'm usually an eggs and bacon guy, but maybe I'll get that tropical acai bowl. You know, That's I want, what I was going to get. I want to feel in Hawaii. Look, they have a display of some of their their offerings. Um, how did we miss the breakfast pizza? They had it there. I'm going to get that. You're going to get that? Yeah. And they got some breakfast bagel sandwiches. And look at the breakfast sandwiches. They don't look half bad as well. Should I just get a Dole Whip for breakfast? <laughs> we'll get that later. So we could just get the boring, you know, standard sodas that they have on the mainland, or they have some Hawaiian sodas, like ooh, that's pineapple orange. Oh my gosh, you have to get one. What is this? I don't know if they're sodas, they might just be juice. Casa guava nectar, passion orange, guava nectar. It says juice drink from Concentrate. Should I get that? Yes. I think every day that we're here, we should try a different flavor. So we'll try them all and we'll let you know which one is the best. <laughs> I'm still gonna get my coffee though. They got the physical distancing markers on the ground as they do everywhere in a Disney resort. I have my white claws here. <laughs> of course they do. Some Maui beer oh. and some Kona Brewing Company, which I actually went to the one and only time that I was in Hawaii, and I remember the food being really, really good there. Oh, wow. We gotta try all the drinks here eventually, right? That's the plan? Sure. <laughs> so, Ulu Cafe is a very small, almost grab-and-go eatery. 
looks like they have a lot of like grab and go options and then you bring it up to the cashier who's right over there. So for breakfast they have a section where they put together the bacon and eggs and sausage and potatoes for you. And then over here they have like a grab and go of all the fruits. And then they got like a whole grab and go of all the pastries. And if you want cereal, they even got the cereal for you right here. Oh my gosh, look at all this amazing stuff. We have gingerbread cookies and these are Mickey shaped macadamia nut brownies. Wow. Um. <laughs> a little dessert for breakfast? So many different kinds of gingerbread cookies. Wow. One of each. They're pretty too. Yeah, they even have gingerbread spiced coffee cake. Oh my god, I. We gotta try that. Look down here, you know I am a connoisseur of peppermint bark. The Mickey shit. <laughs> you just threw it down there. <laughs> yeah. Oh wow. It's a brownie too. We're getting it. Okay, let's get it all. Alright. We we're got on it. vacation, right? Yeah. Oh, we're going a little crazy on the first day, but it's fine. Right. It's fine. As I say, calories don't count when you're on Disney property, right? We have a bunch of candy, but it's like special candy. They have sour watermelons, but then over here they have pineapple gummies. Oh my god. We gotta I wanna try, try it all. We gotta try those at some point. Look at this, they got some pineapple ring candy. And some lychee gummy candy. Oh, we gotta try it all. I just wanna say for a grab and go location, they do have a bunch of theming and art celebrating the Hawaiian culture. Oh no, you found something else? They have Mickey premium bars. <laughs> as well as Hagen does. Yeah. <laughs> They've got it all here, people. It's also funny that they have these speakers hidden around this eatery and they're themed to kites. They also got some dried pineapple, mango, some macadamia popcorn crunch. There's a lot of like cool little foods here that I don't think I would normally see at a Disney resort. Like I said, we're, we have to try one of each. <laughs> we're gonna be here like 10 days, so it okay. is possible. But for now, let's get this and go eat. They have a Lani themed popcorn bucket. It's $8, but you get refills of the popcorn for $1.50 each in it. Puka has all the gang hanging out on the lazy river at Alani. That's so cool. Not all of the items are grab and go options. Some of the stuff you actually have to place an order, pay for it, and then you come outside to wait and it takes like an extra five to 10 minutes. So I decided to get one of the flatbreads and I'm excited for it to come out yeah. piping hot. <laughs> I ended up getting the flatbread with eggs, cheese, and bacon. It looks so freaking good and I love that they like cut it into little squares as if I'm gonna share. <laughs> this tastes exactly like you think it would. The flatbread is delicious. The eggs are nice and soft and scrambled. And then there's like a ton of bacon on there, which I'm not mad at. This is really, really, really good. Seems like a lot though, so I guess I will share it with you. Does it taste like pizza? I've never had like pizza with eggs on it. Um, kind of. I mean, there's no like marinara sauce or anything. Like it's just... Yeah. It almost just tastes like a... You've never had breakfast pizza before? No. I mean, it's just delicious pizza pizza dough with, <laughs> with stuff on top of it. I don't know. I don't know how to explain it. It's really, really good. How many kitchens? It's probably it's like a four out of five. So I decided to get the tropical acai bowl. And this has acai, granola, banana, papaya, mango, pineapple, coconut chips, dragon fruit, and honey on top. And it also has, what is that? It's like a little Mickey. That might be the dragon fruit? Oh yeah, it might be the dragon fruit. I will say, like by the time we got to filming this, it's kind of melted, because we had to wait for Kitra's uh, flatbread, which took 10 minutes after we ordered, which is kind of unfortunate. It's sweet, it's fun, has all those tropical flavors. I'm convinced if I got this before it was melted, that it would have maybe been a close to five out of five Peters. 
but because of <laughs> the way things turned out, it's a little <laughs> soupy. Yeah. Maybe like a four out of five feeders. Is that fair? Yeah. I think it's fair. Does it taste good though? Yeah, I'm gonna enjoy it. I was told by a friend that there was some specialty coffee beverages at one of the little shacks over here. Unfortunately, they were closed. I don't know if that's because of COVID or they're just closed for the day or what. So I ended up just getting a cold brew coffee from inside the Ulu Cafe. It's not bad, actually. It's not bitter. It doesn't taste like, you know how like hotel coffee just kind of like isn't great? Yeah. But this this really isn't that bad. It's very smooth. I added some cream and sugar to it, so of course, you know, that helps. We'll show you later, but we actually do have a coffee maker in the room, so you could stop at like a store and buy some coffee. Maybe that would be the... Oh yeah, that's a good idea. We should go to Target. Yeah, it might be, <laughs> might be the more affordable thing to wake up every morning with some coffee in your room. This is a pineapple orange juice drink from Concentrate, and it says it's the taste of Hawaiian. I know I say this a lot, but this is exactly what it sounds like. It's pineapple and orange mixed together. Is that like Pog without the G? Yeah. Yeah. I think so. so it's good. I recommend it. I saw that there was gingerbread co coffee cake, and I had to get it. It smells so good. I could smell it all the way from here. Look at this. This is like heavy. I haven't had coffee cake in so long. Oh yeah. That was it. This might be better than the pizza. <laughs> <laughs> it just tastes like a very, very delicious coffee cake with like a hint of that gingerbread. Yeah. Maybe the gingerbread is that filling in the middle. Five out of five. No questions asked. This is amazing. So we've been out in this hot sun and this brownie is melty, melty, melty. Why do we always do this? I don't know, we, we, <laughs> oh no, Mickey's face is falling off. I don't think I've ever had a brownie with peppermint crumbles on top. It does make it taste more like peppermint bark. I'd give this like a three out of five. I gotta say, this is not a bad view for breakfast. Looking at the Alani Resort, checking out some of the pools. The beach is right over there. I don't want to go in the water so bad. <laughs> yeah, we'll do that later today. Yeah. And also, I just noticed that there's like the sign on the table, no feeding the birds. When we were arriving at Alani last night, there were some really, really loud like bird noises right outside like where the valet is. Yeah. And I was like wondering, I was like, I wonder if those are real birds or if that's just Disney like <laughs> piping in like bird noises. You never I, know. I'm still not sure. Yeah. They were like really loud. I don't think we got it on film. But yeah, no feeding the birds. So no no here. <laughs> Is this Beauty and the Beast again? It is, it's okay. Beauty and the Beast. I think we bought too much breakfast food. We were very hungry. Yeah. I have like over half of a pizza left in like all of our delicious coffee cake. Thankfully, we got a fridge. Perfect. Save that for later. And right now we're heading to the Holovai Lawn where they're gonna have like a meet and greet with one of the characters. They didn't say who, so we're gonna have to figure it out and see who shows up. If I had to guess, my guess it would be Mickey and Minnie. But that's just, it could be Stitch, could be yeah. Duffy. Fingers crossed for Duffy. Yeah, what if it's Duffy? I will cry if it's Duffy. So we talked to a cast member and he explained that the W in a lot of Hawaiian words is pronounced like a V. So that word is actually hala vi, not hala Y. Before we go meet some of the characters here at Alani, I just want to give a quick shout out to some of our Patreon members. That includes Nate Garza, Eric Larson, Aaron Snyder, and John Corral. Let's go see who's over there. So this is the side of the Alani Towers and right over in the lawn, 
That is where they have the boat where you get to meet with the characters. And it looks like it's Mickey and Minnie. Okay, so real quick, when you guys get to the front, you're going to stand right in front of the stage. Uh -huh. We just ask you to keep your um, face coverings on the entire time until uh -huh. you get to the front. When our photographer gives you the okay, you're free to take oh, off your cool. mask just for the photos. Cool. And then as soon as the photos are done, we kindly ask that you um, place your Perfect. mask back on. Great. Yeah. Cool. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you're you. welcome. They even have the physical distance <laughs> like markers yeah, it, on the lawn. It's like a placemat, like it moves. Yeah. <laughs> Don't want to move it too far out of the what place it's supposed to be intended for. It's funny. <laughs> Um, do you guys know Duffy and Shelly? Yes! Oh my okay. god, they're my favorites. So we have Duffy and Shelly out at 1, 2, oh. 3.45. Ooh. And then Mickey and Minnie will be back later this evening okay. in their holiday attire. Oh my, oh. Yeah, five and oh my gosh, so we have to come back like multiple times today. Hello! <laughs> 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 yeah. How's it going guys? How are you guys doing? Oh my god, I love their outfits. Yeah, your your Hawaiian outfits are like so cute. Oh, your dress, she's got look, ukuleles on there and oh, wow. flowers. Did you make that yourself? Or did oh, and look you, at yeah. Mickey's like, Beautiful. yeah, his oh, little yeah. shirt. Look at his shoes. Yeah. Oh. I need to get a pair of the Converse like that. Oh yeah, those are cool. <laughs> and he's got his necklace. Dang, those are styling. Oh yeah, he's living with the land. Yes, <laughs> my favorite ride. <laughs> oh, oh they like that. the backpack? Yeah, it's like you. Let's see if we can get them in. We'll see you later in your holiday outfits. Oh yeah, I can't wait we'll to see back. your holiday stuff. <laughs> you guys are the best. Yes. Thanks for building Alani. We love yeah, it. Yeah, you guys built Alani, right? Yeah. <laughs> You're, you helped? Yeah, see? <laughs> Thank you guys, bye! <laughs> I think we're like way too excited. We're the only adults here right now. There's really no one. We could have stayed up there for like 20 minutes because there's nobody in line behind us. Yeah. But I mean, that's the first time we've seen characters in so long. Oh, I found one of these guys. Oh, oh my gosh, this is only the second one that we found. I know, we're and really bad at like, find, like seeing these guys. I didn't realize they were going to be inside too. Yeah, I thought they were just like outside in the gardens. I think they're everywhere. All right, two down, 298 to go. <laughs> Thanks for watching, guys. We'll, we'll see, see you on, on the, the next, next adventure. adventure. Mahalo. Mahalo. Wow, thanks. And believe me, there will be lots and lots, many more adventures. Aloha!